Hi, I'm Jesse James Garrett, and I'm the lead designer of Aurora, the future browser concept created by Adaptive Path for Mozilla Labs. In this third scene, we'll see people use a mobile device to share information about things in their physical environment with web-based services and to connect with other people across the web. After the scene, I'll be back with some commentary on the specific interactions that the scene illustrates. What do you think of these as a birthday present for Lori? Isn't her birthday again already? She must be four or five by now. Seven. I see. Well, let's take a look. Mm, I don't know. They look kind of cheap. I would hate to get her another present that wore out in the first two weeks. Her mother will never forgive us. Why don't you check it out on the web? Let's see the reviews. Soft yet durable. Let's buy them. Here is a credit card. Say, we should remind Tim about Lori's birthday. Better remind Kelly to remind Tim. Good point. Let me just find Kelly. This scene is about integrating the web with the physical environment. When the character takes a picture of the slippers, he also captures a unique identifier for them through RFID or some similar technology. He then shares that identifier with a couple of different websites by using a workspace, a browser feature that allows users to pull together different sites and enable those sites to expose data to one another. In this case, the identifier from the slippers on the right side of the workspace is read by the two services on the left, one providing product information and the other providing customer reviews. The credit card is an object in the browser like any other, but here we're suggesting it could be used for physical transactions as well as virtual ones. The spatial view usually contains people, places, and things all mixed in together, but here we see the character use the people filter in the lower left corner of the frame to get a view that only shows people. 